Hello, my name is Ron Z. These are my impressions of the TLWA850 RE, a 300 megabit per second universal Wi Fi range extender. The hardware design is classic, firmware is stable and reliable, and its value priced. The cost in 2013 was over $30. Today, it's less than $20. This is an unboxing review, tear down disassembly, and setup tutorial of a free demo unit received from TP Link for testing and feedback as part of their review program. The demo unit hardware is version 2.0. The firmware date is 5 17 2016. My slideshow gives you the flavor of what the WA850 can do and its setup. The WA850 is a miniature small size, 4.3 by 2.6 by 3 inches. It is lightweight at 3.5 ounces and works universally with all routers 802.11b G and N. It is wall mounted, plugging into any electrical outlet, even two prong receptacles found in older homes. When it's in a top outlet, the bottom one is entirely free for other use. This design makes the WA850 easy to deploy and move about. The WA850 has two buttons. There's a large WPSRE range extender button on the front. It's imprinted with a lock icon picture and surrounded by LED indicators. On the bottom is a recessed reset button as well as the 10 slash 100 megabit per second RJ45 ethernet port. In the retail box are the WA850 range extender, a four foot RJ45 Ethernet CAT5 cable, a one-page double-sided quick installation guide, technical support contact booklet, GNU license booklet, and a thank you for purchasing card containing additional tech support information. The WA850 is based on the Atheros AR9341 platform, 802.11bgn at 2.4 gigahertz. Circuitry appears similar to the Atheros AP123 reference design. Two internal antennas are etched onto the printed circuit board. Experimenters will delight to learn that they can flash open source firmware OpenWRT. Tinkerers may experience some difficulty opening the case. There are no screws or tabs that can be pried open. The plastic shell is sealed with an ultrasonic weld. The WA850 is primarily sold as an N300 range extender working on the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi band. The circular Smart signal indicator LED lights on the front look cool. Blue LEDs are arranged in a circle, going clockwise. Ethernet, power, wireless, range extender, plus five Wi-Fi signal strength indicators. The Wi-Fi signal strength indicators help determine where to place the range extender. At least three of the five signal strength LEDs should be on. The WA850 is flexible and versatile. In addition to being a range extender, it can also be used as an Ethernet entertainment adapter, a wireless network adapter for devices requiring an Ethernet connection, or an access point, transforming an existing wired network into a wireless one. If devices are connected to the Ethernet port, the WA850 becomes a wireless adapter, turning wired devices into wireless ones. For access point operation, on the quick setup screen, 
click the mode icon at the upper right. A switch mode screen pops up. Choose between range extender, extends your existing wireless coverage by repeating the wireless signal, or access point, transforms your existing wired network to a wireless one. Click save for a reboot. In access point mode, wireless devices having WPS capability can easily connect to the WA850 using pin codes. The WA850 has two range extender setup options. There is the easy two push button WPS setup. WPS stands for Wi-Fi protected setup. If your router has a WPS button, press it and then press the front button on the WA850. This gets you connected quickly. The second method is an intuitive browser web-based advanced setup. Either connect a device to the WA850's Wi-Fi signal or connect it using the included Ethernet cable. In a browser, enter the link address tplinkrepeater.net and follow the setup wizard's intuitive instructions. If you do the WPS setup, a browser can be used to fine-tune configuration settings. I use the WPS setup method and then use the browser on my laptop to adjust settings. Connect it to the WA850 Wi-Fi signal. In quick setup, selected my router, Zeus, and entered its password. Accepted the extended SSID name, Zeus EXT, and let the WA850 used the same password and security as my router. After rebooting, a settings screen is displayed with five selections at the left. Status, wireless, network, advanced settings, and system tools. Under status, a network diagram is displayed along with range extender info. Under wireless, there is connected to network, which contains router information, extended network, range extender information. The WA850 remembers previously paired wireless SSIDs, so if the paired router is changed, resets aren't necessary. Under network, there is network settings, DHCP server settings, and DHCP client list. Under advanced settings, there is power schedule, power off times and days of the week, Wi-Fi coverage, max, mid, and min, access control, on off, access control by blacklist or whitelist, online devices, and a list of the devices on the blacklist or whitelist. Under systems tools, there is time settings, time zone, daylight savings time, LED control. In night mode, indicators can be configured to automatically turn off during whatever hours you would like, firmware upgrade, backup and restore, admin account, username and password, and system log. Save configuration settings after you finish fine tuning. On my ThinkPad laptop, the three Windows 10 apps I used while checking the WA850 are Wi-Fi Analyzer Tool, Wi-Fi Commander, and Exerus Wi-Fi Inspector. The WA850 is compatible with TP-Link's free Tether app for phones and tablets. Tether is available free for Android and Apple iOS. It is installed on all my Android phones and tablets. The Android Tether is currently at version 2.7.4. I use Tether to control my Archer C5400 router, RE850D, and WA850. Tether displays detailed information about the WA850. There is a network map, info on devices connected, connection and network status, there are additional screens for quick setup, configuring the extended network, 
shared password, LED on off, block clients, changing date and time, changing password, reboot, and reverting back to the factory defaults. On my Windows 10 ThinkPad laptop, the WA850 was benchmarked using the Edge browser and the Ookla speed test website. Download speed was 45 megabits per second, upload 23 megabits per second. Running the Wi-Fi Analyzer app on an inexpensive tablet, Ookla speed tested at download 29 megabits per second, upload 15 megabits per second. The WA850 comes with a TP-Link two-year warranty and 24 by 7 technical support by phone or email. As with other purchases, your WA850 performance expectations should realistically be in line with the price. In an automobile analogy, you'd expect an inexpensive subcompact car to provide reliable basic transportation, but not luxury vehicle performance and comfort. Most devices in my home have been upgraded to Wi-Fi 802.11ac. Hence, my favorite range extenders are TP-Link's high-end RE580D and RE590T. These are dual-band AC1900 with lots of configuration settings, outstanding Wi-Fi coverage, and high speeds. If you need the best, I suggest that these two more expensive range extenders be considered. My sister's home has only 802.11b, G, and N devices. After completing this review, the tested unit will be gifted to my sister so her family can enjoy and benefit from having a WA850. I hope you found my presentation enjoyable and helpful. Goodbye and good luck.